see the world here. Welcome back. Today we're going to be reacting to my Premier League prediction one year ago for the season 19-20. Let's see how I did. So I wrote myself a graph and it's pretty embarrassing. Most of the predictions were wrong. But yeah, let's get into it. So at 20th place was Norwich and I predicted them to come 18th. Well, that was pretty close. They actually got relegated, so my prediction was pretty good there. Next up, Watford came 19th. This came by me as a shock because I put them really high in the table. I put them as 10th, and they came 19th. It was not really a good result for them, to be honest. Last year, they were doing phenomenal. I don't know what happened to them. They just got relegated, I guess. 18th was Bournemouth. Bournemouth, I put them... 13. Well, I was not actually sure of Bournemouth since the beginning. I don't know how their players play and how their managers are, but I just don't know about Bournemouth. I guess I don't really care if they go down relegated. It was never really a good team anyways. 17. Aston Villa, the newly promoted team. So close to relegated, I put them at 12. That was my prediction. Well, I actually thought they were going to do pretty well as they crushed the championship last last two years ago. And they bought many new players, but I guess they got 17th. 16th was West Ham. West Ham, I predicted them to be 14th. That was pretty close, just two off. I expected them to do a little bit better with Anderson and many more better players, but the manager was not that good in West Ham. 15th, Brighton. Brighton, I predicted them to be relegated, 20th place. Yeah, I did not expect much from Brighton. Well, at least they proved themselves pretty well. They they fought back really, really hard from last season. And yeah, credits to Brighton right there. 14th was Crystal Palace, and I predicted them to be 11th. Well, I thought Crystal Palace would do pretty well with players like Townsend, Zaha, Batshuayi. But I guess 14 is okay for them. 13th was Newcastle. I predicted them to be 15th. I don't think they will do that well, but they actually did pretty well. I think they will do well next season because they will get new manager and they're sponsored by some Saudi Arabian company or something. That's why I think they'll do really well next season. And Stay tuned for my next video, which is making my Premier League prediction for the next season, 20-21. Link in the description. Alright. 12 was Everton. Everton, I put them as 9th. I actually thought Everton would do pretty well considering last season. They were pretty good, but who says? I'm a Liverpool fan. I don't really care about Everton anyways. 11th, Southampton. Southampton, I predicted them to be 17th. I did not expect much from Southampton. I thought they were going to actually be relegated. I just put them on top of relegations, but I guess they proved themselves with, with players they sold to Liverpool and a lot of other clubs. They can, they're, they're pretty good in my opinion. I, th I think I give credit to Southampton right there. Tenth, Burnley. I did not expect this result. Mid-table, Burnley, and I put them 19 relegated. What was I thinking? T to my behalf, Burnley was not in anyone's radar, to be honest, to come 10th. That was pretty good for Burnley. Ninth, Sheffield. Sheffield was a new promoted team. They did really, really well. At some point, they were fourth in the table, but yeah, I'm really shocked with Sheffield. But I put them as 16th, of course, because I didn't know how are they gonna how are they gonna play in the Premier League, and they were just a new promoted team. So yeah, that was good for Sheffield. Eighth, Arsenal. Very, very, very disappointing results from Arsenal right here. Manager got sacked. Players not playing well. Arsenal fans all crying at home. I predicted them to be fourth. I'm sure a lot of people also predicted them to be higher, at least in the Champions League. But, you know, Arsenal, whatever. Seventh was Wolves. And this prediction of mine was pretty close. I predicted them to be sixth. And that was only one off. A lot of people suspected Wolves not to be that high in charts. But I knew since last season they will do pretty well. Their team is at 
absolutely amazing. One of the most underrated teams again, Wolves with Den Donka and so many other players. Sixth, I put uh, no sixth. The results were Spurs. I predicted them to be third. Well, I expected good for Spurs as they got in the Champions League finals last year and they came third also last year in Premier League. Well, I guess there's just a lot of challenges and yeah, not yeah, whatever for Spurs. Fifth, Leicester City. Leicester City could have actually came third, but they lost their last match against Man United, which put them up third. But Leicester, I predicted them to be seventh. They did way beyond my expectation. Brendan Rodgers, what an absolute crushing manager. They could have easily got into the Champions League if they got in the top four, but come on, man, Leicester. I was really hoping Leicester could go in the Champions League, but oh well. All right, the top four. The four that goes to the Champions Leagues and the winner of the Premier League, of course. Starting off with the fourth was Chelsea. I predicted Chelsea to be... Fifth, Chelsea was pretty good. Frank Lampard is an amazing manager. People doubt him a lot, but he's an amazing manager. Got his team together, worked really well. Absolutely crushed him, to be honest, as his first year as a manager. Third was Man United. I hate them so much. They are absolutely gimmick, man. I put them as eighth in my prediction and they came third. I expected them to be fifth at least. Leicester had to lose that match. God dang it. Anyways, moving on to the top two. You already know who it is. Man City came second. Liverpool came first, baby. And that's also where I created them to be. Liverpool first. This is all you. Let's go, baby. Yeah. So, of course, Liverpool came first. We're the champions of the world. And gonna be the end of this video if you like it please like subscribe share and everything and make sure to stay tuned in my next video predicting the next season's table that's it for the video guys peace out